Well, Miley Cyrus gave a recent interview, guys, to Vanity Fair, where she had some pretty interesting things to talk about. She talked about her marriage to Liam Hemsworth, also talked about her recent marriage, and, of course, her favorite person in the entire world, Hillary Clinton. Oh, by the way, how could I forget this? She also tried to educate all of us on marriage and relationships and what it means to be queer and so on and so forth. So this was a pretty interesting interview from Milo. Now, in, her, in the interview, she went on to say that Hillary Clinton, Hillary Clinton of all people, is the one who inspired her marriage to Liam. That's right. She said that her former campaign slogan from 2016, Stronger Together, inspired her, and it inspired Liam. Now, now, to be serious for a second here, they did lose their home in Malibu to those horrible wildfires that took place in California last year. But Molly went on to say that Hillary is pretty much the greatest woman in the world. I mean, I remember she released a video after the 2016 election when Hillary lost, and she was crying in this video, saying that Hillary deserves to be the president. Hillary deserves to be the first woman president. I mean, I'm sorry. No, she did not, and she will never be president Thank God for that, okay? But she went on to, like I said, talk about how Hillary inspired her. Now, the, the last thing I think about for inspiration in a marriage would be for Hillary Clinton's marriage to Bill Clinton, okay? Because I'm sure their marriage, we, we, we know what their marriage is. It's a sham. It's a joke, okay? We know all about that. It's just, it's just all a facade that the Clintons put on for everybody. But we all know they're a bunch of liars. Well, Molly went on to talk about how she got married in December of 2018. And get this. She actually wore a dress for her own wedding, which for her was, you know, a big shock to a lot of people. And she actually straightened her hair. And she said that I wore a dress because I effing wanted to wear a dress. And I curled my hair or I straightened my hair rather because I effing wanted to straighten my hair. She said, me wearing a dress has nothing to do. I'm not trying to be some some heteronormal type of a lady. OK, because she doesn't identify as a woman. She identifies herself as a pansexual or someone that doesn't really identify with either male or female. She said that she is starting a new trend saying it is okay to be a queer woman in a straight relationship. Does that even make any sense to anybody? It's okay to be a queer woman in a straight relationship. And no, I'm not wearing the dress. I don't, I don't want people to think I'm a woman, but I'm wearing the dress because I want to wear the dress. And so on. it's like, this woman is so far gone. I mean, mental illness does not even begin to describe Miley Cyrus. I mean, it's really sad uh, what has happened to her and how she has fallen, how she has embraced this radical left-wing liberal agenda. And it's just, it's just really hurt her. I mean, it's a shame because she could have been something great. And maybe she still can with God. I mean, anything is possible. But uh, she would have to come to repentance and she would really have to give her life over to him. And uh, gosh, just deprogram her mind from all of this garbage that she is being fed. But guys, if you want to see more of that interview, I'm going to put a link in the description down below. You can read more about what Miley had to say. Uh, she uh, had some interesting things to say. A lot of profanity, too, just to give you guys a heads up. But guys, I want to hear from you. What do you think about this? What do you think about Miley saying that Hillary was her inspiration for her marriage and uh, basically giving us a crash course lesson in marriage and relationships and what they are really all about. Because she said that gender, she also said that gender is pretty much irrelevant when it comes to relationships. So I can only take so much Miley Cyrus for one day, guys. But anyway, like I said, I want to hear from you guys. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. Thank you guys so much for all of your support. Please give this video a like and share this video with your friends and family. That always helps me out a great deal. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I will talk with you soon.